What up, y'all? I just wanted to give everybody an update of what was happening and what happened and what happened with my heart and what went down with the surgery. First off, uh, I wanted to just respond to a question I had. I've been off YouTube for about two weeks or so, a week and a half or so, uh, because, of, you know, last year, the, the ending of last year, the last two weeks of last year was just ridiculous. It was sad, it was happy, so much stuff happened. The last two weeks of last year, it's, it's crazy. But I got a comment in one of my videos saying, uh, why did you end the donation fund early? Just in case you guys didn't understand or you didn't understand the one who particularly left the comment, the donation drive was for a deposit for the surgery. I needed a deposit in order for them to start the surgery so they can bill me the rest of the uh, cost of the surgery. What ended up happening was I was sitting here and I had to go to work and uh, my heart rate elevated to 211, which was, you know, it's ridiculous. It was at 211, I was over here sweating and like right here, right where I'm pointing, I was sitting right here. I could barely see, I was getting dizzy, I was hot. Uh, I felt like I just ran two miles at full speed and um, I called my cardiologist. I was like, yo, what do you think I should do? She was like, well, take your medication, which I had some medication that uh, every time I had an episode I would take it and it's supposed to slow my heart down. Bad thing is it only worked once, which is the day they gave it to me, it only worked once. So she said, take your medicine. If it's still this rate at a certain, you know, in like a half hour, call me back and then head to the hospital in Orlando. Don't go to the hospital here. If you go to the hospital here, they're gonna slow it down. They're gonna do everything you ever you have to go to every time you go to the hospital. And then we're gonna send you back home. Took the medicine, sat here for about, she said 30 minutes, but I was like, nah. Sat here for about five minutes, didn't go down, went to the hospital. Now I'm driving, it's like 30, 40 minutes away. I almost passed out three times, it's hot as fuck because it's Florida. I'm um, wearing my work uniform, which I have to wear this Under Armour because I have tattoos. So I had the, the, the Under Armour on, then I had a polo on, and I'm driving, I'm speeding, I almost passed out like three fucking times, I had to pay toll, dropping money and stuff like that, <laughs> trying to hand change and you know dollar bills to this toll lady or whatever. I had to pay toll like three different times, I don't remember. I get to the hospital, and when I get to the hospital, uh, they hook me up to the EKG like they always do. Hook me up to the EKG. The EKG says my heart rate is 211, and the nurse is flipping out because she doesn't know what the hell is happening. I told her what was going on, and I had to inform her of everything. And then that hospital is the actual hospital my cardiologist works at. So uh, where I'm at, he just has an office. Where the Orlando hospital is, he actually has a. Uh, this is where he does his operations and such. So I get there and. You know, they got me there, they're trying to slow it down. They give me this medicine. This medicine they give me, stop, it's supposed to stop your heart and then reset it, right? They give me a small dosage because it's dangerous. They give me the dosage uh, and the way it feels for like 10 seconds, you feel like your bottom half of your body is being pulled off. Like that's just how it feels. So it starts my heart, it resets it. And you're fully awake for this. And then they was like, it worked for a second, but now it's back up to 211 we gotta do it again at a higher dose. This is right after, back to back. So I'm like, fuck, I hate this feeling, I don't wanna, I just don't wanna deal with it. They do it again, boom. <laughs> we do it again, and um, it lasts for a longer amount of time, which is like 15 to 20 seconds now. It just feels like, picture your top body, the top half of your body staying still, and then the bottom half of your body feeling like it's being ripped off. Like, that's what it felt like. Um, so they give me that, work for a little bit, but shoots back up to 11. They call my cardiologist, the cardiologist is like, all right, I'll be there in a second. I'm at the hospital at like 11 o'clock in the morning. My cardiologist doesn't show up until like 6.30 at night. Finally shows up and he's like, look man, I thought you was lying this whole time and blah, 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 blah. And you know, don't worry about it, we're gonna take care of it because this is what I like to do, we're gonna do it. It's an emergency, we gotta get it done. Next day is when they decided to do the surgery. Surgery took five hours, bro. It was a five hour surgery um, because what happened is they go through your groin, they went through the left side with a camera and this little stick thing, whatever. I, I don't really know what, what actually happened, but they stick it through the left side, they, they go up there, they look for what's causing the abnormality, and then they burn it off or they zap it off. Problem was, it's normally up here at the top of your heart, right? So they went through the right side of my body 
and they tried to find it, they couldn't find it. So then they went through the left side of my body and they went through it and they couldn't find it, which is why it took so long. Finally, he finds it and it's in the middle of my heart. Burn it off, I haven't had palpitations since. Um, it feels like I, if you cut an orange in half and you turn it sideways back to back and you stick it on both sides of my leg, that's what it felt like. That's how swollen it was. It sucked. It's still bruised. I just came back from the uh, from the cardiologist. It didn't recover well. The reason why is because once I came out the hospital, I was up and about when I was supposed to be relaxing. Um, and I wasn't relaxing, so it didn't recover well. And then I went straight back to work because, like, you know, we got we to gotta work. Went back to work, so it's still bruised. Like, a big part of my left, my left leg is, like, that much still bruised. So it didn't recover well. So I'm supposed to be relaxing. I'm supposed to be off work. I'm not gonna tell them that, but I'm supposed to be off for another few days, and I just don't wanna don't wanna deal with it. Especially since I forgot to get a doctor's note, like a dumbass. So I mean, they knew about the appointment, but I just I, I was so upset about the recovery going bad that I forgot, and I was just in a rush to get out and make this video. But long story short, <laughs> even though I just told a long story. Uh, the reason why I stopped the fun is because why should I keep taking your money when we had the emergency surgery? You know, because the donation drive was for the ablation deposit. It wasn't for the, you know, ongoing. I already had the surgery, so I stopped the donation fund. I'm not gonna keep, I'm not a dickhead. I'm not gonna keep taking your money and I already had the surgery. That would be ridiculous. Update on that, I just got the check today on my way out to the follow-up because today was the follow-up appointment which is why I decided to make this video because I've been in the slums. I decided to lift myself up because you guys actually care about me so I, you know, I, I love doing YouTube. YouTube is one of the best things that ever happened in my life so I decided to dust myself off and get back into making these videos because you know, missing one day turns into missing three months of YouTube. So it's a good thing I saw the check in the mail. Saw the check in the mail, bust open the check, look at the check, and it tells me the amount <laughs> that I got. Now, this was the hardest thing I ever had to do because I'm looking at all this money and I'm like, yo, I could probably. But then that would be a fucked up thing to do. Let me tell the truth. <laughs> Right under it was a bill from the cardiologist. <laughs> if that bill wasn't there, man, whoo, boy, if that bill wasn't there. But anyway, the bill was right under it. Looked at the bill, saw the amount, and decided, fuck it. I go to my bank, um, turn the check into a money order, put it in an envelope, sent it off to the cardiologist. Didn't touch a single dime, just sent it off. So that money is gonna go to paying off the bill. <laughs> So I appreciate everybody that donated. You, you know, it really humbled me to show how many people actually cared about my life. Like people that I beefed with, people that said they hated me, people that, you know, you know I have a lot of supporters too. A lot of the supporters helped too. A lot of people from the FGC, famous actor. <laughs> um, a lot of people donated and you know, I could get down and do all the names, but that's gonna take forever. So I just wanna thank all a hundred and something of you guys. This is a hundred and, there's a lot of y'all who, don who donated to me and I really appreciate it because it was something that was done out of, out of a whim. You know, I was just like, I'll take a shot in the dark. I only expected to get $20, $25. I didn't expect to get much. And then people just started donating. People I don't even know. People from work. Just, and people f from everywhere just donating. So that's why I decided to stop the fun and not keep taking your money because I did have the surgery. There was no need for me to take any more money from you guys. So I stopped the fun. That's that. So the check came today. Check's gone. We broke again. <laughs> but um, in case you guys are wondering, I already see this Twitch shirt. I do stream. I haven't streamed in a minute because like I said, the last two weeks was happy and hell. My stream is twitch.tv slash Dayasha. And I do stream occasionally. So you will see me streaming again. I'm over the slump. Christmas was great. I hope everybody had a great new year. I hope everybody was safe. I just wanted to give everybody an update on what was going on with my chest and my heart. You know, you guys are the closest to my heart outside of my family, you know, and I really appreciate everything you guys do for me. Because that, honestly, if, if we didn't hit goal, but even though we didn't hit goal, we hit over 50% of the goal. Just to see that, if that doesn't make you want to continue to do 
YouTube and streaming and keeping in touch with your fans on Facebook, which I do. Follow me on Twitch, uh, follow me on Instagram, follow me on uh, Facebook. Um, then I don't know what else does. Because like I said, I only expected to get $25. You know, there's people in my family who didn't even do it. You know, they're like close relatives, like blood family who didn't even donate. So and for a bunch of strangers to donate, you know what I'm saying, it just makes you feel wanted, makes you feel like you're doing the right stuff. So I got some W, I got a WTF plan. Ooh boy, got a WTF plan. Um, and in case you guys don't know me, if you came from event statuses video, which thanks event status, I never thought he would make a video about me because we don't even know each other, but he did, and I really appreciate it. So if you guys came from Event, or if you came from somewhere else, I just want to say thanks, and um, I want to let you know who I am. Uh, I'm a gamer. I play loads of video games. I own a lot of video games. Um, I occasionally stream. I do a lot of YouTube videos. I do some rants. Uh, I do a lot of WTF videos. I love to curse. I curse a lot. Uh, whenever my kids aren't around, I have two kids and a fiance. You know, I do a lot of controversial videos. I give my thoughts on a lot of stuff. So you will be seeing a lot more of me. Don't unsubscribe, dog. <laughs> you guys are here for a reason. Hopefully it wasn't because, you know, I was dying. <laughs> you know, because now that I'm healthy, I, you know, I will hope you guys will be around. Um, I will be going back to the gym because this is why I haven't been going to the gym. We'll be going back to the gym. Uh, the heart thing, like I would do one rep and then I was just done. I couldn't do anything else because my heart would just be So going back to the gym, no, I won't be doing videos in the gym and you know what my workout regimen is and what I take because there's plenty of people out there who do it. Now I know a lot of people do the type of videos I do except for the WTFs. So like I said, I got a good WTF coming up. I'm actually going to film it tomorrow, tomorrow being Wednesday, so this is my first day off in a long time. So <laughs> I'm going to do it tomorrow, and we're going to get it done, all right? So, but thanks again to everybody who donated. Thanks for everybody who's watched. Thanks for everybody who subscribed. Uh, thanks for the people who thumbs up. Thanks for the people who thumbs down, because, you know, if it wasn't for you guys, it would be no me, you know? So, thanks. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, 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 peace. Ah, oh, focus that. The king is back. The king of what? The king of cat. The king of cat. The king of.